What time is it? It is time to play. Hello and salutations and welcome to another episode of Let's Play. Okay, that was a bad, that was what you would call it. It's a series of bad jumps, alright? That's, that's all I was gonna wait for you in today's episode. Yes, this is another episode of Let's Play Super Mario 64. In the last episode, we took on Tick Tock Clock and actually didn't do horribly. We didn't do great either, you know? Uh, just just gonna be perfectly honest with you, we didn't do just fantastic, but we didn't do bad. It, we could have done worse is my main idea. My main point, not idea. Whatever, you know what I'm talking about. So, this episode is probably the penultimate episode. I think we only have this and then the final stage left. I know we only have that left to do. As for how many episodes it's gonna take up, I can't imagine taking up more than two, depending on how I cut. Gatrupe told, I'm probably gonna die. Like a lot. <laughs> I am prepared for that. Just, just, just to let you guys know. Like, I, 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 I know what's gonna happen. So I'm gonna try my best not to get all salty and upset about it. This is, this really is like, this is the last recording session of this game, and I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna do about that because it's also gonna be the hardest recording session of this game in terms of actual difficulty in, in the game. I'm excited though, personally. I'm, I'm very excited because I've wanted to LP this game for a long time and the fact that it's coming to an end this soon is kind of bittersweet. It didn't last as long as I wanted it to, but I mean, I guess I shouldn't have really expected it to. It's Mario 64, this is not a very long game. Even when you're 100%ing it, it's, it doesn't take a whole lot of time. I'm not entirely, I'm not sure like what my total playtime is, but it can't be more than like 10 hours at most. Either way, it's been a fun ride. A fun rainbow ride to be specific. Fire? No fire, please. It's been a really fun ride and I've certainly enjoyed it. I don't know why I'm talking like this is the last episode of the entire series. I shouldn't be doing like all my farewell speeches and everything so soon. Otherwise, I won't have anything to talk about next episode. I really am pretty excited about it though. The only problem is I have no idea what to follow it up with because my next planned LP, I cannot see camera, thank you. My next planned LP uh, was supposed to be Fallout 4, and that's not out yet, and it's not going to be out for a little while, too. So I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to be doing about that. I may end up just having to go full-time Majora's Mask, or maybe doing some more, like, face cam videos that aren't necessarily horror games. Oh god, don't fall. I'm going to be, like, soup. Okay, okay. Camera, cam, cam, camera, camera. Thank you, sir. You just, you're trying to screw me right now, and I don't, I don't appreciate it. I really don't appreciate it. On the bright side, though, we actually got the first star without dying. That was unexpected. I don't have high hopes for myself, all right? I've learned to keep my, uh, expectations on the small side, uh, because pain, pain and anguish. Get in the hole! Thank you. Jesus. <laughs> That was, that was legit rage there, or legit, like, upsetness. Is that a word? No. But I made it one, so I'm alright with that. So how are you guys doing today? Hopefully pretty, pretty good. I'm actually having a pretty good day so far. Uh, yesterday was my first full, uh, you can call it a management shift, even though I'm not technically a manager. Uh, for those of you who don't know, I switched jobs a while back, and I, uh, I uh, went to work at a jewelry store, of all places. Uh, and it was my first time in the shop, like, by myself all day for a full 12 hours. And it was actually really, really good. I mean, we we didn't do fantastic, but at the same time, the store didn't burn down. So that's a success in my book, personally. It went pretty well, and I was actually in a really good mood when I got home, even though I was exhausted. So I went ahead and did some editing and everything else. And I just woke up today, like, really happy and... Yeah, I didn't get any calls when I woke up this morning saying that I screwed something up. <laughs> Which I was kind of half expecting. So, I don't know, I'm in a really good mood, basically, is what I'm saying. Which is also one reason I decided to go ahead and record today. Uh, or try to record this last little bit, because, like I said, this is probably going to be the, the last recording session of this entire series. So I want it to be big and flashy and ultra cool and... Yeah, right. Anything I do, being ultra cool is a laughable concept in and of itself. Okay, Rainbow, I need you to come back here. Jeez. <laughs> Alright, everybody just saw that, right? That rainbow track just straight up disappeared for no apparent reason. This really is one of the harder levels in the game. Probably... Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Uh, 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 get back here! Okay. Probably the hardest level in the game. In, in all honesty, in terms of... 
Death's Had. I think this is pretty much higher up there with pretty much anybody who's ever actually like 100% in this game. Also, pretty much. Because I just needed to get it in a third time, alright? Was it the actual third time or was it the fourth time? I don't know! Point is, I say things too much. Uh, one of the only bad parts about this level is that while it is difficult, a lot of the, uh, deaths that come from it tend to be- <laughs> Flame kissed butt right there. A lot of the deaths tend to be a little bit more on the cheap side because of the camera messing up or, you know, just random crap like that. This is actually, I talked about it a little bit during Wet and Dry World, um, this is one of those levels, and I know a lot of people share this opinion too, that I feel like they made pretty early on in development because it seems like there's not a lot of cohesive thought and theming to it. I mean, it's in the sky and all that, but it seems like they just kind of threw together a bunch of assets and, and made them, strung them together with a rainbow, which it is awesome in concept, mind you, stringing things together with a rainbow. But it's one of the few... Get out of the flame. Okay, thank you. Am I gonna get this first try? This is one of the ones I had a lot of problems with when I was uh, practicing. This is one of the few levels that doesn't seem to really have a lot of cohesive thought put behind it. Not in a bad way, mind you. I mean, they definitely thought about the stars and... No! No, no! What's in here? This is a one-up. Probably a one-up. Yeah. Yeah, give me that one-up. Give me that one-up. Give it... One-up! Get back here! Jeez. Trying to run away from me. We got a second star, so that's pretty neat. Yeah, this is one of those levels where it doesn't seem like there's a lot of major theming or, or, or thought behind it, besides just the regular concepts and, and how and what stars there are and all that. Uh, similar to Wet Dry World, where they just kind of it looks like they threw a bunch of assets together and made it a level. Now I will say this one, in my opinion, is, is a bit better than Wet Dry World. In my opinion, in my opinion, in my honest opinion. Uh, because I, I feel like this one came later on in development stage than, than Wet Dry World did. I have no proof for that. None whatsoever. But I really do feel like this was one that came after that. And then some of the other levels like Bomb on Battlefield, uh, the mountain levels and, and all those came after these. That's my opinion. That's my theory. I don't, I don't know if it's true or not and it may entirely well not be. Yush. But I feel like it is. Alright. So we need to go over here to the coin maze which is... Yep this area. Yep. This is basically just another red coin mission. We've had these before a hundred times over. It's not that that thing, big a thing at all. But it's still something to, to do. I'm sorry. <laughs> I keep trying to think, like, because this is one of those levels I'm, I'm having to concentrate on a pretty decent amount. And it's actually pretty hard to commentate while playing this particular level. Which, I mean, that's not a bad thing, because that just means that the difficulty level is a little bit spiked. It does spike a little bit here in the last uh, area of the game. This game, in general, does have a pretty good, like, difficulty slope. But, uh, here, especially in the last area, TikTok Clock, uh, Rainbow Ride here. It, it, I don't know, something about it does seem a little bit more difficult than, than the normal slope would allow. I'll put it like that. Okay, can I just not get up there? I'll just, get, I'll just go back down here. No, bomb mom Don't you push me off, bomb mom No! I refuse. You blow up. Nobody loves you, bomb I'm sorry. That's uncalled for. I'm sure somebody loved you at some point in time. It's just right now, you're a villain. And, uh, well, people love villains, to be honest with you. <laughs> That's why we have, like, TV shows and everything else. Really? You know what? Why don't we just try and do the, the wall jumping up here? That, that would probably be a little bit easier. <laughs> I just want the red coins. That's all I want. Just give me what I want. Jeez. It's not even that hard. I'm making this look way more difficult than it actually is. You know what? Whatever. I'll take it. Really? 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 Get up the freaking slope. Good. Yeah. Mario. A good goose shot. Okay. One more to get. And it's right there. Yay! That's really not too bad. The bomb bombs will kill you. Kill you. Whew, I thought I was going over the edge. The bomb bombs will kill you quicker than anything else in this in this uh, little coin maze here. Luckily, we didn't have to bother with them too much. Yay! We're not doing awful so far. We haven't actually died. I I'm not really sure what to say about that. <laughs> I expect this to go a lot worse. Although we are, we're only halfway through and. 
We haven't even started to talk about the Hunter Coin mission yet, so... <laughs> it's gonna be fun. Swing in the breeze. We actually... I don't know, we may end up not doing this whole level in one in one episode. I may split it between two. Either that or I may make, like, uh, the next one be, like, the last half of this world and then the uh, Bowser stage, because the Bowser stage probably isn't going to take me too long. But then you have, like, the ending credits and all that, and I'm really trying not to have another, like, super long finale of, an, of, an, uh, of a series either. What episode is this? This is, like, episode 21 or something like that. This one went really fast. It, it re what star am I even on? Swinging in the breeze! I don't really wanna. But I mean, if, if I gotta, I mean... If it has to be done, it has to be done. Uh, <laughs> I'm sounding so, like, salty about it. Is there, is, this series is, like... I don't know. It kind of rejuvenated me a little bit. I, I wasn't getting tired of doing LPs or anything, but... There was some times where, here recently... I was sitting there thinking about, okay, like, I need to record, I need to edit, or something like that, and it felt a little bit more like a chore than, than most most LPs do. Uh, and I'm talking about, like, Super Paper Mario and some of my, my ones I did here recently. Uh, crap, oh crap, oh crap. Get it, get it, get it, go! Get it, get it, get it, go! Alright, fun. Uh, stupid sponge cake. Uh, what the crap was I even saying? Oh yeah, like Super Mario and some of the other ones. I, I did enjoy them as a whole, but near the end, they were getting a little bit tiresome. And, uh, I don't know, it was getting me a little worried, like, whether or not I should keep LPing. Because it's one of those things where I don't think I'm going to quit anytime soon, but if it honestly gets to a point where it's too tiring or, or not worth it, then, I mean, I may stop doing it. I, I won't stop, like, in the middle of an LP or anything. I'll finish whatever projects I'm doing. But, at the same time, it just, it's, it's one of those thoughts that kind of creeps in every once in a while that maybe it's about time to call it. Oh god, I hate this one. But, this one kind of rejuvenated me a little bit on that, because it it's really made me... I don't know, it's made me like fall in love with that, that old school feeling of doing LPs again, which is, is awesome. Uh, because it, I haven't gotten that feeling since... I don't know. Maybe like Ocarina of Time to a to a certain degree, but that was one of those games that I played so much that it, it did still end up getting a little tiresome sometimes. Yoshi's Island was probably probably my most fondly remembered LP. When I first came back from that little hiatus and I played uh, uh Mega Man X Blind, which I need I need to LP another Mega Man game here soon too. Uh, when I first came back from that and played, really, really, you're killing me, Smalls. You're literally, you're literally killing me. Like, I'm actually going to die from this. Uh, when I first came back and was playing Mega Man X Blind and then uh, Yoshi's Island and all that, that was, like, prime time for me. That's when I was probably the happiest I have ever been LPing. Uh, and certainly things have come close, but that, that excitement and that feeling I haven't really gotten in that degree since then. Minish Cap to a certain extent, but that was mostly because I had a whole lot of viewership then. Minish Cap was by far, 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 first try! Heck to the yeah! Sorry, I'm really excited because that is one of those stars that gives me a lo gives me a lot of problems most of the time. Dude, we're actually gonna do this in one episode! Oh my god, can we actually do this without dying? I know I, I just completely jinxed myself by, by saying that. Somewhere over the rainbow, way up high. This is the last star to get. Besides the Hunter Coin mission. I cannot believe that. Uh, ooh, sorry, I got a little excitable there for a second. Uh, but yeah, like, this, I haven't really gotten that excitement. I haven't really gotten that excitement in quite a while. And it, it, when I started, like, the first and second episode of Mario 64 gave me that same excitement that I haven't really had to that degree since, like, Minish Cap. Like I said, Ocarina of Time had its moments and it definitely came close, but... It still wasn't like the old days. And I hate to sound like an old codger or anything like that, but I don't know, like, I guess anything you do for so many years, you tend to just kind of get a little cynical about it, maybe? And that, that may not be the correct word to use, but a little bit, it, it loses a little, little bit of its luster over time. And I think e even with the bigger LPers, if you go and ask them, you know, do they feel the same excitement when they start a project versus... Uh, back in the day when they were still like a smaller channel or something like that. I'm sure a lot of them will say yes. 
Especially, like, some that are known to be, like, super positive, like Markiplier and a few other people. But at the same time, like, I feel like any anything you do, like, for a long period of time, uh, over the course of several years, even if it's something you enjoy, like, a lot, even if it's something you really, really love doing, it still is going to lose a little bit of that luster, just because you're doing it so much. I mean, ever since we, I came back, when I got my new computer and I came back from the hiatus after Minish Cap, uh, so started with Diddy Kong, and that was in uh, early 2014, if memory serves. So I'm going on two years now <clears throat> without any other hiatuses or anything like that. Is that right? Did I get my computer in? Yeah, it's been almost two years. Holy crap, it's been almost two years. Um, ever since then, like, I haven't taken any major hiatuses or anything like that, and I've stayed relatively constant. I, I had daily uploads there for a while, and then they got down to, like, I think the lowest I've gone since I came back was three or four a week. Uh, and I've, I've, camera, 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 I've stayed with that schedule for two years now, and it's just, as much as I do love it and I enjoy it, you have to think, like, every day, I need, oh, I have to go talk to the pink bomb on. No! I actually made it here without dying. I'm just gonna go ahead and say that now. I'll speed it up because I want to prove that. I have yet to die on this entire stage. I'm, I'm very particular about that. Thank you, Pink Bomb Mom. I should have talked to you when I was here earlier. I didn't think about it. Alright, we're back on the ship. And we have the, the, the cannon open. We still haven't died yet. I have not died this entire... Really? Okay, I thought that spiny was gonna, like, glitch me out or something. I have not died this entire level. I have not died this entire level. This is the moment of truth. If I can actually hit this pole and do right, I would have made the entire of main... all the main stars in Rainbow Road without dying. Oh god, I'm so friggin' nervous. Oh, uh, please, 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 please. Yes, 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 yes. Oh god. Oh god, am I actually gonna do this? Am I actually gonna do this? Holy crap! I know I'm like super excited about that, but I've never done that before. I have never, I don't, not that I can remember, and I feel like I would remember this, made it through all of Rainbow Road without dying a single time. Oh, I'm so excited. Now we still have the 100 coin mission, but I don't know. I don't have my hopes up about that. I'm going to go ahead and leave the 100 coin mission in there too. We've done really, really well uh, this entire go round, so I'm going to leave this in here, oddly enough. All right, um, what I was saying earlier though is like, I just, I don't get that, that level of excitement very often anymore, but Mario 64 especially has really given me that. And Majora's Mask too. Uh, again though, it's just one of those games where I've played through so many times that it does still kinda lose its, uh... almost awesome <laughs> almost I mean I uh, maybe I can still like be relatively okay and, and finish this in one and uh with only dying one time I mean still like for anyone who's played this game they'll vouch for me on this only dying one time and during the hunter coin mission no less would be pretty good for this level I feel like that'd be something to be proud of I really really do because this is a hard freaking level <laughs> I can't believe it. It wasn't even on a hard jump either. It was just on regular old jumping back on the carpet. What the crap, John? What the absolute ball sacks. Oh. I am so disappointed in myself. I mean, I still made it through the uh, main six stars without dying. And I'm, I'm definitely happy about that. Like, I don't mean to get... I need you. Get... No. One up. I need you. Come here! Thank you. I'm still pretty happy about making it through as far as I did without dying. But dang, it would have been so cool to make it through everything without actually dying. Oh, God. Alright, alright. Enough, like, hating myself. I, I would have felt better if it was at least on a hard jump or something. That, that wasn't even, like, a good death. That was just a crappy thing. <laughs> that was just utter crap is all that was. Oh, I'm so, so sad now. 
No, no, no. You know what? Screw you. I'm not. I'm not wasting time on one coin. What was I even talking about? Oh yeah, like the feeling of excitement. I know I've been like sticking on that subject a lot, but I mean that's. Oh god. 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 Get the coins. Get the coins. Oh god. Eh. Woo. That could have been worse. No, don't, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump yet. No, 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 okay, well, see, now, we are having issues. <laughs> it all it takes is one death, one death, and all of a sudden my confidence is like, gone, complete. Com, ah, dang it. All right, I'm actually gonna come over here and take the mansion, or mansion, excuse me, the maze out, uh, because I remember there are some blue coins up here that are actually kind of tricky to get. And if memory serves, you actually have to get them in order to, uh... Oh, God. Really? Really? If memory serves, you actually have to get these to, to get 100 coins. Oh! Bye! Bye, Felicia! Ugh. All right, we missed one, but I think we can get by on that. Oh, jeez. All right. <clears throat> I'm start. I was starting to get a little worried there. Not even gonna try and lie about it. I think we got it though. We just have to be like super careful and not die. I already killed you, bye, mom. Go away. You don't have anything I need. You don't have anything. I'm a strong, independent Mario who don't need no bye, mom. All right. <laughs> ah. So remember about that excitement I was talking about that uh, this LP has been giving me? Yeah, it's gone. It's gone. Gone forever into the depth of suckitude. Ugh. I don't even know what to say anymore, man. I was so happy. I was so, like, stoked because I'd been doing so well. I was so, like, stoked because I was doing so good, and now I'm, it's just gone. It's just gone to, to be forgotten forever. Gone. Gone, girl. Gone. But you know what? It's alright, because it's still going to be the final recording session, and finales always make me super pumped anyway, so it's it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Ow. Okay. It's okay. If I just keep telling it to myself, then it'll be true, right? Isn't that how it works? Ugh. I may end up speeding this up after all. This is one reason, like, I don't try, I don't try and commentate a lot during the hundred coins missions, uh, because it honestly is kind of hard, especially in later levels like this. Well, uh, I tell you what, I'm gonna, I am gonna go ahead and speed this up, but it'll be a quick one, hopefully. Assuming I don't die anymore. It's that, mm -hmm. That'd be nice. I'll see you guys in a second. Old Spice Body Wash can't block odor for 16 hours. And jump, 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 get it! Yes! Here we go. I just want to. Bye, bye, Mario. <laughs> yeah, go ahead and say. I thought he was thinking out of existence there for a second. Oh, okay. I just want to point out that if I hadn't missed that last blue coin, I would have had that a long, long time ago. All right, that's it. <laughs> Save for this episode. I ended up speeding it up when I didn't really want to, but you know what? It's all right. It's done and over. Two days daily question. I want to know if you would like to see a Mario Galaxy 3 or if you'd rather it have some sort of new concept in the next 3D Mario. 
I want to know your opinion because I have a few of my own and I want to talk to you about them. So leave them in the comments and it'll be fun. As always, like if you like, leave a comment, tell me what I did right, what I did wrong. Subscribe if you want to see more and please share with friends and I will see you guys next time in Let's Play Super Mario 64 where we will be doing the finale. It's the new dance craze sweeping across the nation. Do the finale. Do the finale. Alright. I'll see you guys next time.